Before the video starts, I just want to let you guys know that in today's video, there's going to be a giveaway. It is very easy to enter it as well as very easy to win it. Now, I'm giving away four factory sealed video games and these are all at various different values. So that means there's going to be four different winners of this giveaway on today's video. Now, it's very easy to join this giveaway. All you need to do is make sure you're subscribed to my channel, you like this video and leave a comment. It can be a random comment if you want. At 2,500 likes on today's video, I am going to be picking four random comments, making sure they're subscribers, and each comment that I pick, they're gonna win one of these games at random. I'm gonna be pinning every single comment as well, so you guys can see once this video hits 2,500 likes. That means the faster this video hits 2,500 likes, the faster there's gonna be four subscribers winning sealed video games. So make sure you guys join this giveaway and I hope you enjoyed today's video. Good morning. Do you know if this PS2 works? It does. We just don't have any of the controllers or anything. Both are broken. Do you have any games for it by chance? Mm -mm. Was there any other game stuff that you had? No, just that one. Okay. Would you take 10 on it since it's missing everything? You're for sure it works? Mm -hmm. I mean, yeah, it was, we just got rid of everything else. Okay, I could do 15. Okay. Good morning. Hi, how are you? There's 15. Okay. Thank you. Did you have any Pokemon stuff? Like Pokemon cards at all? We don't, no. No? Mm -mm. Okay, thank, thank you. Thank you. Um, so those are my neighbors. You said you would do 50 for all four. Good morning. Good morning. I'm gonna let somebody know. We did never used it. Okay. Um, is there a passcode on it? Do you know? There is not a passcode on it. Do you have an iPhone charger? Uh, I don't on me. Okay. Because let me see what this. Did you try turning it on? No. As long as it powers up, should be fine. It does. Yeah. And I don't have anything on here. I never used. I got it for when he was a little, you know, a little younger. Um, okay. 
We can do five bucks, dude. I just want to get rid of every. Okay. What about the headphone? Um, I think these are my wife's. The Beats. I'll get the wires in there. Two for ten, both. That's fine. I appreciate it. Yeah, thanks, dude. Appreciate you. Thanks. Good luck with the rest of the sale. Yeah, appreciate it, man. You know anybody wants baby clothes? Send them my. <laughs> I got you. Thanks. <laughs> Good morning. Movie trailer, fuck a piece. Okay. Would you do 10 on this amp stand? Sure. And would you do 10 on the Roomba? Sure. Cool. So I owe you 20? Mm-hmm. Do you have change for a 50 by chance? Yes, we do. Yes. So you're $30 back, right? Yeah, 30. All righty. I don't keep it out here, so hold on one second. Okay, that's fine. Thank you. I appreciate it. No problem. I still think you need that cash piece right there. <laughs> Oh man. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. I hope it's a good morning. <laughs> Better than yesterday. Yeah. That rain was a good one. Oh yeah. How much is your cookie jar? $5. Okay. How much for your your filter stuff? The whole thing, um, with all the little screws and stuff, it would be, um, just like $150. Oh, okay. My neighbor's putting one up and they just have those little small filters, so I'll tell them about it. Yeah. I mean, it's kind of like, uh, we should have done it at the beginning of the, the season, but, you know. I'll keep looking around. Okay. <laughs> Amen.
How much are the shirts? Okay, I got nine shirts and a hoodie, and then the cookie jar. So we got ten and five. 15. Okay. Thank you for packaging that up for me. Hey, it's the mom and me. <laughs> All right, so what, 15? Is that what we said? Yeah. Yep. Be careful. Thank you. You're welcome. Take it easy. Good luck with the sale. Thank you. How you doing? Hey, how are you? Good morning. Okay. Did you, he's got them, most of them out. Did you have any do you have any Wii games or any Wii? Wii, Wii system? I think you I'll go check them if you might. The only Wii game I know would be for the Wii U. Any zombie game over there, but let me go check if I have any. Any like PlayStation or any other video games? I, besides the ones like right there, let me go see real quick. Okay. Resident Evil, and then this is just like a VR game. If okay. To check these out. No Wii or anything. And nah, I think at the last garage that we had, they were just all sold. Okay. Sorry about that. Any systems that you're trying to sell? Uh, original, original Xbox One, maybe. Do I think? I would take a look at it. This is, I know this is the main hard drive and everything. Okay, did you have the controller or no? Oh, I do have an extra controller. Whoa. I do have an extra. You want me to get it? Or? Yeah, I would, I would buy yeah. a controller with it. Yeah, Jesus. <laughs> yeah, you could just set that down. Yeah. Yeah. Right. yeah, that is the old one. It's yeah. like a dinosaur. It's heavy. Yes, <laughs> the new one. Oh, the new ones are still, I don't know. Not as heavy, you're right. <laughs> How much did you have on your Skylander? Uh, was it even on there? I, have, I didn't know. Oh. He was like maybe getting the character by itself. Did you have the little, uh, there should be more um, figures to the little ones. Like I think each little one have oh. has like a little crystal to, I, to I actually remember, play yeah. the game. I might have them if not. I guess yeah, five bucks. Okay. But I'd have to. I don't know if it has all the. I'd have to see. Okay. These How two? much did you want for the Xbox? Xbox forty bucks. Okay. And then what about the controller? Controller. This one will be ten because that's just per, like perfect condition. This one's good. Just I, now this one might have stickers, so I'd probably prefer this one. This one has no back though. I, oh, okay. But this one will be five it's bucks. Probably in that little I have them on, I just don't, none of them fit. Would you take uh, 60 for all the controllers and all this? Yeah. Okay. And then I'll do five on your Skylanders too, so 65. Yeah, if I want this one. Yeah. That's and then good. if you can check if you have those crystals, that'd be awesome I'll too. check this. Let me, or do you want, do you want the box of this too or no? That's fine. Yeah, and, just take yeah. it. Let me go see if I have them. Okay. I'm sorry, I can't find them anywhere. Okay. Sorry about that. Well, I got brand new golf clubs. I don't think I need these, but 
Thank you, sir. I 65. Yep. What kind uh, of golf club is that a... Uh, I'll be honest, these are just my old ones. I have no idea if you... I have more if you wanted to check them out. Let's put them right here. But I also have a 360 console if you will. With the control, two controllers. If you were looking at that or not. What would you want for that? Tuesday, I've written, written down some stuff. Uh, is it the white one or the black one? Black one. Is it the... I have a black and a white one, whichever one you would prefer. Okay. And I could just give the other one to Dan, whichever one you do. What were you asking for? Uh, for that and a controller, 30 bucks. Okay, did you have any handhelds, like DS? Do we still have three? Well, I think we have a 3DS, or did you get rid of it? I don't know what it is. There was games, but I can't find them. I know we had that. I'd be interested in a, th a 3DS or a DS. I'd have to search. I don't know where. I don't think we have a 3DS. We might, but I doubt it. Okay. I could give you my number, and you can just shoot me yeah, a text if you, if wanna... you fi whatever you find. I mean, if you make a big pile of all the video game stuff you don't want anymore, I could yeah. probably just take them off your hand. <laughs> Not <I> have dogs. <laughs> <laughs> I sent myself a text. All right. So yeah, whatever you find, uh, just, yep. I mean, if you want to put it all in a pile. All right. all right, garage sales are pretty much over with. It's noon right now, but I'm actually heading back to one of the sales that I went to earlier that I got that Xbox from. And I'm buying everything else that he owns that he no longer wants. Tons of video game stuff, as well as a golf driver. So I will see you guys once I get there. Let's see. Uh, let's see if it fits. So we got everything, the club. All the game stuff. That'd be cool. You said 190? Yeah. Thank you again. Yeah, for sure. Uh, change. There you go. Thank you. Appreciate it. Take it easy. Thank Good luck with everything. Thank you. All right, so I'm back at home, huge haul. As you can see, we spent $305 on all of this stuff, and I'm gonna break it down for you guys to show you exactly how much everything is worth. First up, I'm gonna do all of these consoles that you see right here. Obviously, I have to do some more thorough testing off camera to see if they actually work, but right now I'm just going to see if they power on, and then I'm gonna also see if there's a game inside. I'm gonna tell you how much I paid for them as well as how much they're selling for. First up, we have the PS2. Is there a game inside? Yes, there is. Tetris Worlds. I bought this for $15, just the console, and this is how much it sells for. Here's the PS4 Pro. Now, this is one of the most valuable out of the entire lot of consoles. Is there a game inside? Yes, there is. NBA 2K21. Bought this in a bundle deal of $190 plus a bunch of other stuff, so it's kind of hard to calculate how much I paid, but imagine each console probably about 30 bucks. So this is the PS4 Pro, paid about 30 bucks for it, and this is how much it sells for. Here's the Xbox One S. Let's see if there's a game inside. Yes, there is. We got Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Siege. Paid 30 bucks for this, and this is how much they sell for. Here's the OG Xbox One. Let's see if there's a game inside. Looks like this one does not have a game inside. 30 bucks for this one, and this is how much they sell for. Here's the original Xbox 360S. Let's see if there's a game inside. Yes, there is. Lego Batman, the video game. And I paid $30 for this, and this is how much they sell for. Here's all the other video games that I grabbed, and most of these came with that lot that I paid $190 for, but these few on the top are probably the best ones. We got MW3, Call of Duty. We got Lego, Lord of the Rings, and this is sealed. We got Resident Evil 7, Biohazard Gold Edition. And we got Left 4 Dead. We got Minecraft, Xbox One, it's just the disc. 
And lastly, we got Elder Scrolls Skyrim VR. And those are probably the best games out of all of them. I don't even think uh, COD MW3 is any good, but this is the rest of the games we got. And they're all mediocre titles. Probably lot them with all of the consoles that I have. Here's all the controllers that we got, plus that PlayStation 4 VR set. Now I think the VR set with the two controllers sells for around 50 bucks. I may be mistaken, I'm not sure. But take a look at all of the controllers we have. All of these Xbox One controllers, just tons of them. Most of them have the back, but a lot of them don't. I'm gonna assume that they're about $25 a pop. So we got six of them. So if you do the math, that's a pretty decent amount of money. And then we got two PS4 controllers that we can sell with our PS4 one terabyte Pro. So that's always nice. Yeah, probably paid anywhere from 30 to $40 for all of this stuff because a lot of it was included in that bundle. Here we have an iPad and some Beats headphones. I think these are solo HD headphones. Paid $5 for the headphones and $5 for the iPad. Now this is an A1489 model and it totally works. I tested it, I charged it up. Yeah, it's totally functional. It's, I bought a freaking iPad from a garage sale for $5. The only problem is it does have a small hairline crack, if you can see that. But it's still probably like a $40 or $50 iPad and we paid $5 for that. These headphones I did not test yet, but I think they sell for about $30 and $5 for those as well. Here's some Skylanders that I paid $5 for from that same kid. And I don't think there's anything tremendous in here. I was asking about the trap pieces, but he didn't have the little trap pieces. So this is all we can grab. I know the portals are worth some money, but I just wanted the figures for five bucks. And I don't think there's anything crazy in here. I think this is probably a 30 or $40 lot and they sell pretty quickly on eBay. But if I'm missing anything, please let me know. I don't think there's anything super valuable in here, but then again, I could be mistaken. Let me know in the comments. Here's two shirts that I bought at one sale. I bought 10 pieces of clothing together, and one of them was this hoodie, which is not for sale, but these two were both vintage racing shirts. So this is a Dale Earnhardt number three, and it's a Good Wrench Service Monte Carlo, I think it's probably from the early 2000s and it's Chase Authentics and XXL. It's in really good condition, really good size on that shirt. And then this is Tropicana 400 Chicago Land Speedway and July 13th, 2003. This one's in really good condition as well. And this one is an XL, so they're both really good sizes. This one I think is selling for about 30 and I can't find this exact one because there is so many on eBay, but not this exact one. But I think this one would probably sell around 50. Here's the rest of the shirts that I bought. One of these is a National Rifle Association shirt. And this is probably vintage, if I had to guess. All of these shirts are extra large. So we got one NRA shirt, and then we got six Harley Davidson shirts. And the Harley shirts all range from the late 80s to the early 2000s. A lot of them are Chicago based or Milwaukee based or anniversary based. And there is a few plain ones, but I would say probably 20 bucks a piece on these at least. I don't know if there's any ones that are worth a little bit more, but I'd probably ask around 80 or $100 for the six of these in one entire lot, unless there is a standalone shirt that can sell for a lot of money probably close to 80 or $100 on these, and we paid a dollar a piece. And then this one, I would say $20 as well, although I can't find any sold comps on it, but it is very cool. Here's some other miscellaneous stuff that I grabbed, and we paid $5 for this and $5 for this. This cookie jar is nothing special. The only reason I picked it up is because I'm gonna keep it. I have a very, very fat orange cat, and ironically, he doesn't like fish. So I thought it was funny. So I'm gonna keep this. Probably sells for around $20, but $5 on this. And I shouldn't have bought this because I have so many of these. And they take a long time to sell, but when they do sell, they sell for decent money. This is a JVC DVD and VHS combo. $5 on it. I think it sells for around $60 or $65. But I'm gonna have to test it and I'm gonna have to store it 
and I'm gonna have to wait for it to sell. And I probably shouldn't have bought it because I have so many of these, but if we can sell it pretty quickly, we can make some decent money on it. Here's a driver that I picked up. It also came in that bundle that I paid $190 for. This is a Callaway XR Speed, and it's in pretty decent condition. The handle's nice, the shaft is nice. There's only one tiny little flaw, and there's a dent on the top of the driver. But the kid that I bought it from said he's on the golf team, and this was his main driver, and he's hit a ton of golf balls with it. These sell for around $100 used, but with that dent, probably take off $30 around there. So this should sell pretty good, even though it still is a dent, but we only paid $10 for it. So whatever we sell it for, we're gonna make money on it. The last two items of the day is this combo amp stand and this Roomba. Yeah, these are some two pretty quirky items, but this Roomba right here, we paid $10 for, and then the amp stand we paid $10 for. And I do think that this Roomba is the 694 model, which has the Wi-Fi connectivity to it. And it sells for about $90 used if it does work. So that's actually a good buy. I've never bought a Roomba, but I knew they were expensive and they're a good brand to look out for because a lot of their products sell for a lot of money. So we got the Roomba and then we have this amp stand, which is ironic because I just bought one for my actual amp and I really needed one of these. These sell really quickly in my area locally, so I should have no problem selling this. They sell for $60 new, so I can probably ask 35 or 40 if it's in good shape. Okay, so it looks like we have close to about $1,150 of retail value if everything does decide to sell and if we sell it all on eBay. Now we need to take into consideration all of the fees and shipping costs of eBay, which is gonna be close to about 250-ish dollars and then the $300 that we paid for everything, which leaves us at an estimated profit of roughly about $600 if we decide to sell everything on eBay and it all sells. A lot of this stuff I can sell locally and mitigate all of those fees and shipping costs. So I'll probably make a little bit more than $600 on all of the items that you saw today. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Make sure you like this video as well as subscribe. It helps me out a ton. I really appreciate you guys watching my videos as well. It is crazy how far we have come. 25,000 subscribers almost, and I started last year, which is just mind blowing to me. I really appreciate you guys and all the things that you do for me. I appreciate all the comments. I do read them all. I try to like all of them as well. Just keep doing you guys, and I'm gonna keep doing me. I really appreciate you guys watching me, and I will see you in the next video.